Well, I, I keep saying like for me, um, I already lived kind of like a lockdown lifestyle because I pretty much all I do is stay home and work anyways, uh, pick up my kids from school. So I would say mainly, um, obviously my kids are not in school. <laughs> so that's definitely been like a different thing for me, just having them home all day. And then also um, my business has picked up even more than it was before. So, I mean, as you see, I'm down here at my warehouse because we just, we have so many orders um, and I'm trying to just like rein things in. Um, so I would just say that, you know, the things that I was doing before, like yoga, meditation, um, eating healthier, you know, not just eating, um, uh, high sugar foods or drinking a lot of alcohol or I understand like people still want to have fun sometimes and that's cool in moderation, but you've got to kind of change how you were doing things before because you want to build your immune system, you know, and, uh, now's not the time to be reckless. I preach about that a lot on my page. Like now is not the time to be reckless with like how you're eating and, and drinking and stuff. So why am I having trouble putting these earphones in? <laughs> Um, what else? Um, if you have, if you live in a city that has like good weather, you want to get out in the sun and go for a walk. You don't want to just stay indoors, you know, um, things like that, I think are super helpful to this, this time. I have such great respect for teachers because they have to deal with kids all day. <laughs> and it's a lot different when you're dealing with like I have a one year old, so it's a lot different dealing with her than it is a thirteen year old or a nine year old, you know what I mean? Like everybody has different personalities, emotions, attitudes, whatever, like needs. So man, I have a lot of respect for teachers now. <laughs> like more so than I did before. Um and it's also teaching me like just like more patient you know i think all of us have to be a lot more patient right now because oh lord everything from like your amazon packages to you know like i think the only thing that's come quicker right now is like postmates like postmates is on point right now but <laughs> um like amazon your prime you know it used to be like one or two days and now it's like no bro like you have to wait especially if it's not something that's essential you know, going to get people used to just be able to run to the grocery store. You're not running to the grocery store anymore. Like it's all you have to map out a whole plan. So all of this is just teaching us like patience and I guess less entitlement. The restaurants and the movies. I used to love going to the movies. Like that was one of my favorite things to do. And um, like traveling, you know, just like being able to go somewhere with a beach, going to the beach. <laughs> like you can't even go to the beach in LA. So I definitely want to do that when, when quarantine hits. Yeah, and I think also when stuff hits the fan, it's like you don't have nobody to blame. You know what I mean? Like you could say your label, blah, blah, blah. A lot of people can talk about their labels. But if you're not on a label, then it's like, okay, now what? You know what I mean? So um, I think the thing that keeps me motivated in music, I would say, is just my love for it, like my true love for it and how feeling it is. But I'd say in life, it's my desire to help others because like, I would say I'm like, I'm good. Like I'm fine. But if you always push a little bit harder when you're concerned about like people around you or the collective or, you know what I mean? Like if you're, if what you're doing is helping other people, then that motivates you to get out of bed, you know, when you could just be complacent um, or be lacking ambition. Or just be satisfied because like, oh, I reached my goal. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, that and being in competition with, with yourself rather than other people, I think is super important. Like always trying to outdo yourself, not looking at what like the next man is doing, you know? Well, it actually worked out because being in quarantine, you know, you can't have a whole crew or even like, even like having a love interest is kind of like, it's not the time for all that <laughs> so it worked out because it's about self-love you know what i mean like yeah in the song i'm singing to a guy but in the video i'm saying it to myself and doing all the things that make me feel like self-love and self-care 
you guys follow me on instagram at kcola definitely get lucid dreams on itunes spotify apple music all of the streaming services have it and um i'm gonna be working on a meditation album because i think that we all need like some healing and meditation right now so you guys be on the lookout for that